Follow me to hear your oracle message. I can feel the mist on my face. Ducky. I love it. This way to your oracle message. things you can eat. Did you hear that? What if it's Bigfoot? What just fell from the tree? This here looks like a good place to do your oracle reading. Yeah, right where that butterfly is. Hey y'all, what's up? Did you like that little hiking trail? Right? Yeah, come in here to do your oracle reading. That's right. So I'm doing Capricorn Aquarius oracle reading in nature. Loving it. Right by the little creek here. Hear some of that water just streaming around. Right? All right, so I'm going to try to shuffle these up the best I can because I'm out here in all the rocks and sticks. I didn't think of it. Ah, that's an airplane. Sorry, there's an airport over there. <laughs> Ooh, ready for takeoff, right? That's a good sign. Maybe some of y'all going on a trip. Let's see, let's find out. I'm gonna pull five cards, right? These five cards are your winged ISIS setup, okay? So, five cards, let's pick them. Random order, three, yep, four, one more, five. All right, those are your five cards. Let's get to reading. Okay, the first one is really gonna be, um, what's the real issue for you right now spiritually, okay? On a spiritual sense. So your first card was the bottom, because the bottom is the top. Okay, so your first card here, 
the Divine Sun Child. Blessings of the Sun flow to you now. It is time to allow your life to flourish without limits. Let to let your light burn bright and without veil. Just like the midsummer sun burning without contest in the Egyptian desert. It is your time to shine bright. That's sweet. Oh my goodness. All right. So your second card, huh? Okay, I do reversals. Okay, so this one was reversed. Okay. So what this one is really going to um, tell you is that what it is that will best heal you in your day-to-day -day situations, right? Let's flip this bad boy over. Here it is. Life restored. Spiritual resurrection is gifted to you now. Whatever part of you or your life you thought to be dead is being revived and will flourish back into life just as the phoenix rising from the fire transition from death into life so to you will rise again healed and renewed that is in reverse this is your problem you can't get to get past things you can't let some of the things that you thought were dead bring them back to life this is your stuck mode okay let's get to this third card this is also in reverse this is the ankh right but this is the mother of life okay so this is the gift or the outcome to this day-to-day -day thing that is in reverse where you will be so flipping it here it is mother of life when it comes when life seems dry depleted filled with repetitive tasks and simple stagnant and stifled isis the mother of life holds the ability to revive even the most numb resistant and difficult circumstances in your life she calls to you now seeking to bestow gifts upon your life so behold be brave be bold open your arms to receive this is why you're stuck because it's like you don't want to take things given to you as a gift or an opportunity you feel in your way that you could do it and you get it for yourself and all that but you're stuck and you and you're being offered some divine assistance here okay so let's get to that fourth card How many, how many did I pull? Three, four, five. Yeah, I pulled six cards. Whoops. You yeah, know, we'll take them all. Let's just do that because they're already here. Okay. So here is your fourth card. That is in also reverse. This is going to represent what is the biggest challenge or opportunity for you to have the best outcome. And it's reversal. So let's flip it. Okay, so this is the Temple of Carnelian. It is time to trust in your own boldness and courage. Taking risks that feel true to the heart and imagining and engaging in practices that you feel truly and genuinely make you feel alive. In body and more of this of yourself, even if it is not always comfortable. Are you going to help your, you live life the way you were born? to live life that is reverse so it's like you're not being your true self you're not letting yourself shine you're holding yourself back it's it, it and you have this boldness and this courage within you that you need to let explode out of you because you're being divinely guided this way okay here's your number five this is straight up okay so this is divine sisterhood so this is the spiritual uh special guidance that will help you resolve things and this in the best way for your life okay divine sisterhood letting the divine feminine nourish you now into new relationships collaborations community and friendship is very wise there are many souls of whom you have spiritual contacts decided upon before you were born who wish to help you and whom you can help too as you grow together in peace light and wisdom what that's crazy just telling you okay i don't know i there's only five cards for this spread so i pulled six obviously so this is like a bonus okay so we'll just say uh what special help are you going to get through all of this i mean it's kind of like the number five but just go with me here okay so you have the wings of isis it says you 
my friend. Have a very special spiritual relationship with the angelic worlds. Part of your soul purpose is to birth angelic consciousness and values such as fearlessness, compassion, and service into this human culture. This oracle also brings you angelical assistance, intervention, and confirmation to what? Oh my God. You know what to do. You heard your directions. You know you're getting some help. So be bold and courageous, my friends, and accept that. It's an internal help that you're going to feel this knowledge and this pull on you. And you're going to be able to just let that shine. Okay? So be brave. Be bold, my friends. Take that. It's a very spiritual, deep message for you today. Oh, yeah. I'll see you again, my friends. Peace and pray. Have a great day. Well, I hope you enjoyed that little hiking trip slash oracle message for y'all. Well, I'm going back to the truck. Getting hungry. See y'all later.